Hello ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to the Book of Anderson Tales with me, Brazen Braden. I hope you're doing well. Uh, I'm not doing so well. Uh, by me, I, I, I mean uh, our lovely lass here. We're still in the old caves. Uh, or the, the, the temple, rather. Uh, and we've lost two of our fellow uh, groupies down the old hole, as you can see. I've thrown this over because it's getting bloody cold. <sighs> it's a miserable looking day, but I love it. I'd rather it be cold so I can get warm. If it's too hot, well, not much you can do, eh? I guess go lie in a pool and then you get all soggy. Yeah, well, whatever's Okay, let's switch over to... Let's switch over to the other guy. Because uh, we can go down into the darkness, apparently. I don't know if we want to. I think that could be a bad idea, but... As long as it's pitch black, I'd rather stay put. Okay. For all I know, I could be standing on top of a slim stone column surrounded by piranhas with clubs. I guess. I guess that's that's true. I can see nothing. No light, no sight. I'm not going to get desperate and then grope my way around the walls trying to find an exit. Well, not yet. Okay, so there was a few things that he could actually do and say. Let's see if Wilbur has something that's more to some say. That's some sort of stone slab. I can't move it. Is it always that's just the same thing? Sort of okay, he always just says the same I thing. Fine, 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 fine. Let's get back to her. I, I, I really need to move my camera, don't I? Um, where's a good place? Uh, how about up in this top corner? What you reckon? Okay. Give me a second. I'll be right back. Hello. Okay. I've moved. <laughs> I have relocated myself. Uh, so we can better see these these fellows up here. These these lovely fellows. I guess they have to form some kind of com. Okay. So we need to find. What? There has to be something else in here. There's there's nothing more we can do. We've got fishing rod. Shall we fish out some jellyfish? We can probably throw it down to the old uh, to the guy in the dark if we can get one. But it's not allowing me to do that. Uh, is there anything more we can inspect? Hmm. Are you gonna say more about this? It looks absolutely beautiful. Come on, fish them out. You know you want to. It makes perfectly logical sense. And we lost our machete, by the way, for whatever unknown reason. Touch the crystal. Okay. Wow, that looks very promising. Only nothing else is happening. Oh, and when I let go, it turns off. So that's why we need three of us. One for each of the crystals. I see, I see. Okay. Peculiar face. There's an... Okay. Why can't we fish these guys up? Wow, this is the most obvious thing. Yes, just get one. Get one, woman! Ay, 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 ay. Okay. Uh, and she doesn't want to go in here. I'm not going down. Okay. Okay. Let's call into the abyss or something. Perhaps I could climb down there. But those two would never make it up to the top. Okay. Can I? If I should just leave them down there and fetch the artifact myself, I could come back once the artifact's safe. She has a a lot of uh, confidence in her abilities. Perhaps I could climb one. Um. The rope would be long enough to let down to Wilbur, but it's too thin for him to climb up. Is it? Uh. Do I need to go fishing for a fish? Uh, to to do something with I don't know they, uh, no I, I couldn't outside there was no I couldn't click on the water could I what about now from this perspective perhaps I could climb I wonder if I should the rope would be nothing okay I'll, I'll, I'll be back with you in a sec when I figure it out hmm, the alcoves have opened again the worms the fish and the fairy have disappeared The fish has disappeared along with the water, but the bucket still looks okay. Really? If you could have at least shown me that there was a bucket there, that would have been helpful. The Can we get the jar? Remained in the alcove. I'll take that with me. Gosh, you know, I mean, if they could give a visual cue uh, or clue that there was still something there, you know. Uh, okay, so we've gotten a bucket and a glass jar, which means we can now, I guess, uh, put jellyfish into the bucket. <laughs> And uh, and then send that down so we've got some light. Oh, I wish I had some sort of visual clue, honestly, now. 
Scoop up some jellyfish. Okay, put it, attach it. To the rope. Attach the bucket. Now use that to scoop up some jellyfish. Oh, come on. Okay, jar. We'll throw some, some honey, I guess, in there. I don't even know what, what she's doing. These jelly glowfish have presumably never seen a bipedal being. They're okay, very so they're very small jellyfish, apparently. Uh, can I put that in there? The jelly glowfish is in the bucket. Okay. Now I can send that down to the old uh, captain. Captain. W what is he? I guess he's a captain. He captains the ship. So he's a captain. Okay. Off you go. Hey, Wilbur. I'm sending a jelly glowfish down to you. Wee. Ah, look at the light it produces. Good Bugs. gracious. Hey, there's symbols on this door. Ah, sweet. What do they look like? Something that looks like a snail with a long neck, a fish without a head, a sort of branch and a star. Well, that's all well and good, but could you throw the light down to me now? I can't see my hand in front of my face down here. Sorry. Sorry. What do you see? Oh, wow. A passage. No idea where it leads. Out of it's all hole, lit up. I hope. Okay, we've lit up the entire area. We also have the code. Or the combination for this. What sort of symbols were on Wilbur's door? Something looking like a snail with a long neck. A fish without a head. A branch and a star. Branch and a star, okay. There's a star. That could be a... Is that a branch? My word, these symbols are really old. Uh, a snail... A snail? A fish without a head. What is that? What are these things? Could that be a fish without a head? Definitely the star is. That one's definite. That could be a snail, actually. Is there one of those? Yes, okay. So that could be a snail. A branch must must be that. And then a fish without a head. Maybe that's not a branch. Is that a branch? Snail. I don't know. Uh, how can I get out of here? Oh, up there. Uh, what was it? Repeat it. Ah! Snail star. Fish without a head. And a branch. That's like a dandelion. I guess that could be a branch. Oh, there's a button! Oh! I see! Okay, uh, a fish without a head. Oh. That should be it. Oh, there we go. Done and dusted. The door's open, Ivo! Egg salon. Things in the temple are controlled with these stone discs. Presumably one of the priest's little games. Open sesame, that kind of stuff. My question is, how would you ever know the combination to that if the symbols on that door were sort of blocked off by a floor? You have to break the floor to get down, to find the symbols, to put them up there, to come back up and rebuild the floor. Very impractical. Let's get down to Wilbur. And uh, see what he's got in this level here. Okay, Wilbur, come on through. This guy can't... Oh, maybe he can't get across. Get in there. Okay, what is going on here? One of the stones has fallen out of the wall. Sooner or later, the entire temple will collapse. Mm-hmm. One of the stones is fall. Oh, he just wants to say, say the same thing. Ooh. 
Okay. Oh. How do we get up now? <laughs> uh, will it take us back up? Oh, sugar. Whoops. Looks a little like my Aunt Ethel. That's a bit rude. Maybe the mouth can be opened. Nope. Looks a little... Okay. Can I climb up those? Even at this depth, there are still roots, and it looks like they keep going down. Maybe I could reach them with Cap and Nate's help. Okay, so I can use... I can, I can get up that way. Uh, and that looks very dark. Uh... Captain Nate. Captain Nate, could you give me a boost up? Captain. Why Cap should I? Then I'm. Then I might be able to reach the roots. And then what? Well, then I pull myself up. So what good does that do me? No, oh, man. Stop um, asking questions. Well. Gosh, he's maybe irritating. I'll find a way to get you out of here. Huh. All right then. Ah, he's irritating. Come now. Stop asking questions. Just do it. Okay, good. If so not, now. I'll wait and celebrate later, when I'm out. Yeah, all in good time, all in good time. Now, let's get Wilbur to look at this thing. Whatever that is. A sort of a hatch with a wheel. <clears throat> it's no okay, use. so he's not strong enough to open that. We need uh, Cap'n Nate to to do it for us. So we need to get him upstairs. Why does Wilbur have to walk so far away to just, you know, allow me to switch places? Uh, go stand on this platform, chap. Good man. Now, Wilbur, come stand on this platform. Somehow, the, the, the Nomi is going to weigh so much that it's going to bring Captain Nate up. Or not! <laughs> <laughs> Fine. Uh, okay, that was, I guess, logical. Uh, Captain Nate, can you climb up the... Well, well... Okay, I can still do things. The roots are hanging pretty low, but still too high for me to climb. How, why? The roots are... uh, what else? Head. What an ugly mug. I hope that's not who built the temple. The figure's mouth looks like it should open. But not like that. Okay, so that's what's probably going to open up the the figure's mouth. Can we get in here? Oh, we can. It's very dark, though. Oh, hello. A big wheel just crying out to be turned. Well, let's turn it. But it won't turn. There's a oh. little catch stopping it. Well, take off the catch. As long as that catch is there, I can't turn the wheel. And I can't see any way of releasing the catch. Okay, fair enough. Um, what about you? Can you come across and get down here? Or do you refuse I'm still? Going down. Okay, I'll fine. To it. Fine, fine, fine. Let's get back to Wilbur. Uh, hmm. Maybe if I go down? No, that wouldn't work. I've just had a thought of what I need to do. I need to push this rock onto this thing to make me heavier. That's it. Then I can pick up Captain Nate. Push the stone. That's quite a chunk of rock, but I might still be able to move it. Boom. Move it. Onto there. It works. There we go. Together the stone and I are heavy enough. Away with you. Okay, Captain Nate. Oh, where to go? Captain Nate, can you turn this thing, please? Let's see. Ah! He's done it! That was it. The hatch is open. Okay. Hmm, a small passage that leads into a shaft. But I can't squeeze through the hatch. I'm too big. Oh, my word. Okay, fine. We'll have to swap around again. Get on there. Get on. Off you go. Okay, now play with Nate. <laughs> we, we're gonna play with Nate. <laughs> oh, I just saw that now. Play with Nate, play with Wilbur, and then end it off by playing with Ivo. Oh, wonderful. Okay, so I guess from there with Wilbur, we can then maybe unlatch the 
The big cog wheel thing? Maybe? Uh, we'll find out. Oh, we'll find out. Come on, Wilbur. Get your ass through there. Okay, what do we got? Climb the ladder. Alrighty. Ciao, Nate! <laughs> We're out! <laughs> We're out of here! The ladder leads up into the dark, and the shaft gets narrower up there. Okay. Oh, I can go there, though. Let's see. Let's go have a peek. Aha! We're at a crystal. Hi, Ivo! Wilbur! I found a hidden ladder. It brought me here. Brilliant! What's that glittering up there with you? It's a crystal. This, a crystal. Oh, can you throw it down? I've got an idea what it Don't might be Don't drop it for. into the jellyfish. I have to keep going. Uh, oh. Having adventures, avoiding traps, revealing secrets. I think I've underestimated you, my little friend. Yes, you have, Ivor. He's quite capable. Can we take this, whatever this is? What is this? That's a stone tablet. It bears the same symbols as the ones you see everywhere on the walls. Take it. Thank you. Ah, look at that. So maybe these are different passcodes for different things. Interesting. Okay, what else? Nothing up here? Alrighty. We can probably give this to Ivo and then she can use it to uh, do more combinations. Let's go talk to her. I was looking for a way to open that door. I should too. Okay, let's give her the tablet. Look, Ivo, I found a stone tablet with symbols on it. Really? Show me. Hmm, I think that's just what I'm looking for. Thank you. Okay, we now can we do something team. here? Now, don't get overconfident. <sighs> so much prattling. The symbols on the stone rings are the same as all. I'll let Ivo take care of Okay, yes. I did actually mean to make let Ivo do it, but. Anyway, let's change the stone rings around. It will, un un it will release the clasp. All right. So at the moment we've got none of these. Okay, let's try the leaf, the fern, the star, and the seaweed. See what that does. The combination's correct. But there's still something not quite right. Okay. So this one on the end didn't work. Maybe we need to start on that side. So we'll go with the sea this the the, the 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 snail, the shell, the whatever that is. And the whatever that is. Ooh. Oh hmm, that sounded like something's happened again. Yeah, something did happen. Nate? Can you tell me what's down there? What's this? Ah, the figure's mouth is opened. There's something like a switch inside. Okay, can we switch it? I don't think it did anything. No, it didn't do anything. Uh, oh, it did! What a... Interesting. Although I don't think you need to be on on there, Nate. Uh, you can. I think you can get off. Okay. Oh, it's enough. It's it's a working elevator. Ah. Okay. That passageway wasn't here before. No. Could be interesting. Yeah. Fortunately, once again, it's only big enough for an. Okay. Okay. So Wilbur, we need you back. This is very backwards and forwards. Very backwards and forwards. Come, Wilbur, my son. Need to come down. And head in through this passageway. See what we see. Come on, get get through the door. And into there. The passage is almost as small as the hatch over there by the ladder. I can't even see where it goes. So go and have a look. <laughs> So ah. That's where this leads. Okay. Is there another crystal there? Yep. Yes. Excellent. Well done. 
just puts it into her side <laughs> and absorbs it. Bloop. Those would be some horrible kidney stones. Good gracious. Okay, well, we've got all the crystals now. Um, let's go back to Ivo. And let's try another one of those combinations. See if something else happens. Something different happens. So we've done this one. That did a bunch of stuff. Now we want to find the shell, the weed, the whatever those are, and the fern. There. What does this do? Hey! <laughs> it's unlatched the thing. Okay, that's that. Okay, we need we need to get uh, Captain Nate back. Uh, and we'll step on this platform when it arrives one day. Get on the platform, Captain Nate. I uh, must I wait for the water? Is that what the story is now? There we go. Get to, to the old wheel. <laughs> what happened there? Good gracious. Uh He's stuck. He's stuck in time. I, I can't I can't click anything. Oh wow. Uh bug <laughs> Oh that was we bugged out. Something has gone wrong. Uh Oh no, oh no, he's stuck in the he's stuck in the Oh well guys I can't do anything. I can't escape. Uh, I'm stuck in apparently some sort of animation and I can't bypass it or anything. Oh disaster story. Okay, well, I apologize. I'm going to cut this episode a little early because I'm going to have to replay everything I did from the beginning to get back here. Because this thing doesn't autosave, as far as I know. It's manual saves, and I can't. I can't. I can't get to the exit menu to do whatever. Oh, well, sorry about that. It's not, oh, not my fault, so I guess I don't need to apologize. But uh, these things happen. Uh, we will see you for the next episode soon. Uh, so in the meantime, you can check out some other stuff and uh, and like and subscribe and that sort of thing. And uh, I will catch you all soon for the next one. Until then, love you all and bye.